Hello and welcome to another Photo Party Upload video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we're going to cover video integration, which means we'll be able to take a video with our photo booth or our camera and then send that video over to the iPads where we can browse, select, and then upload to social media networks and email. Now I'm going to cover three main things in this video. One, how to enable videos in your events. Two, how to add a pre-roll video or a promo video. And then three, how to add a custom watermark or a logo to your videos to really maximize that branding effort. I want to point out the types of video files that Photo Party Upload will accept. If I click on the helper and I open up my transfer folder, you can see I already have a video in this folder. Now this video is a .mp4. Photo Party Upload accepts .mp4, .avi, .mov, .mpeg, .mpg, .flv, and .ogg. These are the types of file formats that Photo Party Upload accepts and can transfer over to the iPad if dropped into this watched folder. Now let's get started. The first thing we need to do is log into our account at login.photopartyupload.com. Once we log in, we can create a new event and we will create our event for tomorrow and this will be a video test and we can simply fill in all of these fields click on next now for this video I will enable Facebook and we need to click on wall message we also need to click on generate unique URL now if you're not sure how unique URLs work you can click on this link here in the video to watch another video to learn about unique URLs so for the Facebook option we'll check this box here we'll enable wall message and then we'll also check generate unique URL now for Twitter we'll check Twitter we will also check generate unique URL and lastly for email we'll check that box and we'll check generate unique URL you always need to check this now we need to check this box here upload video to enable videos we'll scroll down a little bit more and this is where we can add a promo video and we can add a video overlay now I'll keep all the other settings the same and I'll click on next now I can put in a wall message title and this is the blue text that will appear on Facebook so I will put and we can enter a description And that's the Facebook. Now for Twitter, let's put All right. And so this is a pre-entered tweet that I'm entering so that whenever somebody tweets their video this will be the message. Now they do have the ability to delete this and write their own. Now for email, I'll put in a real email address which is working, subject. Your videos have arrived. And for the body of the email, thanks for coming to our event. Now you can put whatever you'd like in here, maybe a link to your website, maybe more text. Now for the unique URL I'm going to upload a header image 
which cannot be any wider than 940 pixels. Now I've already created one right here and I'll just select that and I'll scroll down and I won't upload a background image and I won't do a page title or a page description. I won't do any analytics on this page. Uh, this is just very bare bones um, just to show you how this works. Now for a promo video we're going to click on this button here that says upload a file. Now the file needs to be a .mp4 um, video and it cannot be any larger than 10 megabytes so just remember that. Now if you need to convert your promo video into a .mp4 format there's a link here that you can click on and that will open up this window here where you can then upload your video and have that converted to a .mp4. Now if you don't want to upload your video there's a piece of software called Handbrake and it's free it's available for Mac and PC it's great you just download that you import your promo video you press convert and it will spit out a .mp4 so I've already done that here's my pre-roll promo commercial I'll select that that will begin uploading here's my video overlay so the video overlay needs to be 1024 by 768 pixels and it needs to be a .png file so here's Photoshop I've actually already created that um, template here I have a logo in the bottom right hand corner I've actually taken the opacity down to 60 percent so it doesn't completely shine through it's more of a watermark and I'll save this file here as a .png now I've already done that and I'll click on upload a file and I'll select my video watermark and once that completes uploading we can click on next and that'll bring up this screen where we can accept and that should create our event so now that we've created our event I'm going to upload a video from the iPad to Facebook to show you what that looks like so I'll do that now okay so I've uploaded a video to Facebook and I have Facebook open here and we can see how this looks so here's my Facebook wall I had a blast doing this video this was my caption and so I uploaded this video and you can see here's the blue text that we entered in previously and here is the description now here's the little thumbnail and when I click on that thumbnail it will bring up this window here where you can see my header image that I uploaded I didn't upload a background image you can see that this is just white and then you can see here's my video and when I click on it it'll play the promo video and then it'll play my part of the video so that is how video uploading works for photo party upload and if you have any questions please feel free to contact us at photopartyupload at gmail.com we'll be more than happy to help you out Thanks so much for watching and good luck.